What's up guys, I'm Suman from Phonesteen and if you guys start building a gaming PC for a low cost like say 15,000, 20,000 was difficult I have come up with a PC build that you can do for just 20,000 Indian rupees and the best part is that I just uh, did a little bit research on the older generation of the products like the processor and graphic card and did a little research on how it performs in day to day scenarios and my I have coupled the best parts and here is the build guide. So without wasting any time, let's get right into it. Now for the processor we have the Intel Core 2 Duo E8400. So this is again one of the best chips that was released during its timeline. Yes, this is a dual core chipset with a clock speed of 3 GHz. So that is ridiculous and amazing and Koto Duos are uh, really amazing performers as I've also used them in my first computer and the best part about this is that it has 6 MB of L2 cache which is again great but the best part is the price. This costs only 900 Indian rupees. Yes the release price of this was around say 12,000 uh, approximately like that 12,000 10,000 rupees but now we are getting this sucker brand new only for 900 Indian rupees so that's great and the links to this will be in the description down below so you can check it out for the motherboard we have a motherboard from the Intel G41 chipset lineup now the best part about this motherboard is that this is an LG Sun 75 socket type yes but it supports DDR3 RAM not all LGA775 motherboards support DDR3 but this sucker supports here and it doesn't cost a lot and the maximum uh, frequency of the RAM supported is 1333 MHz which is again wicked and talking about memory we have a DDR3 kit from a company known as Simtronics don't worry it is a good company and I have uh, researched about it so you need not worry about that so a single stick is a 4 gig stick and we are going to go with 2 so that's a total of 8 freaking gigs and yes now this is awesome 1333 MHz not the best but still decent enough to handle all your tasks be it uh, gaming especially this is, that is why this is intended and this will also help with multiple chrome tabs and all those weird kind of stuff that you are going to do and now talking about the hard disk now this is the place where I've been a big conjuice. Yes, I've been a very big conjuice and gone with only 160 gigs of 7200 RPM hard drive from Western Digital. Yes, you can go with an SSD, but to keep cost less, I did this. And uh, if you want to reach the 15,000 mark, you can put a one terabyte SSD, uh, sorry, hard disk or. Uh, 120 gig SSD which is up to your wish. And now talking about the graphic card which is the star of the show we have the NVIDIA GT710. It has 2 gigs of video memory. Yes it is DDR3 but you need not worry about this. I have tested I mean I have researched about it and it can definitely support your modern AAA titles like maybe GTA 5 or uh, Battlefield 4, Call of Duty at say around low to medium settings at maybe 720p so that is going to work just fine and for the first time gamer i think that itself is a big boon now housing all these parts is going to be the techcom cabinet and the best part about this sucker here is that it has an inbuilt power supply and this is a 450 watt power supply not going to be the best like a corsair power supply or an evj smps but this is definitely going to get the job done and will definitely serve you for say 2-3 to three years without no problem at all. And it even looks stylish for what you're going to pay. It has some like carbon fiber textured finish with a red accent and you get various other colors too from which you can sell it. And now here is the build guide. And if you guys think this was an awesome build guide definitely hit the like button cause I will definitely be building this in a couple of months after making sure that I have enough money to get all these parts but anyway the build is coming soon and you guys stay tuned for that cause that is going to be amazing but anyways thank you for watching and this is Suman signing off once again catch you later